I cannot represent an administration that does not value all human life, about three years. This administration, Gaza, Palestinians in Gaza, food, water, electricity, fuel medical materials cut and ongoing collective punishment tactics to stop the most powerful ally. Of Israel as the most powerful ally I cannot be guilty. Disease hunger. Habish wrote Habish. Israel and its supporters strongly denied that military campaign was genocide and said that many deaths are partly the result of settlement of Hamas fighters. Biden's other Biden management official who resigned support Israel, Josh Paul, who worked on weapons transfers to foreign forces in political military affairs office in political military affairs office ministry foreign affairs. Habish was first political appointment resigned from Israeli policy president. Biden's Hamas militants killed 1,200 Israelis and after taking 230 hostages on October 7, Israel's unshakable embrace. Unlike other problems during presidency, he resisted cease-fire calls for killing more than 80 percent of population and creating a humanitarian disaster in densely populated settlement. The president and its supporters argue that Israel has other options destroy Hamas after terrible attacks and that there are civilian losses coming from Israel's efforts to avoid them. Palestinian death is upset, but very few explained their names their concerns. In an interview, Habish stated repeated U.S. vetoes of United Nations decisions that would call a ceasefire and condemned Palestinians' collective punishment INA for playing an important role in resignation decision. In his letter, Habish said that as a Palestinian-American, brought a critical and not representing perspective, he said it was not given. In last three years, the White House has published a large number of press releases stating that it is most diverse administration in history and it reflects America. Habish also said that Biden's policy is re-elected and therefore the future of American democracy at risk, because he does not approve of many Democratic voters, including young voters.